Hey guys, this is Robert with Bad Luck Garage, back with another LS Tech Tip. Uh, today is going to be a really short video. What we're going over today is how to wire your OBD2 port. Guys, like I said, real short video. This is going to take all of two or three minutes. Um, when you're wiring your OBD2 port, uh, all you're going to need is, see if you can see in the connector here, you're going to need pin 2 which is your serial data line. You're going to need pins uh, 4 and 5, which are both grounds. And then you're going to need pin 16, which goes to a 12 volt constant uh, or, you know, just 12 volt battery. This does not get wired to your uh, switched ignition, guys. This, this has to go to a constant 12 volts. All right. Um, the only other thing I, would, I need to say about this is your your grounds here, pins four and five. Uh, different year models use you know one or the other. So my suggestion is you know no matter what you're wiring, just go ahead and hook both of them up, pins four and five, and I just tie them together into one ground. And then finally, pin two. Your serial data cable uh, that just needs to go to pin 58 on the blue connector on your PCM all right guys that's pretty much it like I said short and sweet um, you know those are the only four wires that you have to hook up when you take these out of your donor vehicle some may have an extra wire or two but those four are all you need definitely the only note I want to make is uh, like I said earlier different PCMs uh, use either one or the other of these grounds or some might use both so you're always better off hooking both of those up if you don't hook them both up uh, you could have issues with um, you know if you're if you're hooking up a scanner because you've got a check engine light or something it, it may not uh, may not be able to communicate and pull the codes correctly or um, if you're using a product like um, HP tuners or, or other tuning software, you may have trouble uh, reading or writing your PCM if you don't have, you know, the right ground hooked up. So just just go ahead and save yourself a headache and hook up both those grounds. That's it for now. So like, share, uh, subscribe, and uh, I'll see you next time on Bad Luck Garage.